So what Coach Chris is, let me give you guys, uh, so I'm gonna give you guys an example. Um, so I'm actually gonna go through to Dan houses and <clears throat> this is my example. Um, my goal is to give you guys, uh, give me a second, sorry. Um, I'm gonna give you guys advice. I'm gonna watch some of you guys' battles and then um, give you like, hey, you should do this, hey, you should do that. Let's see if I can see. Uh, here you go, Soul Reaper. I gotta find Dan House. I'm gonna give you guys advice. Let's see. No, I don't see Dan Houses. Um, let me look for Dan House real quick. Vaughn, 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 Vaughn. But it's where I'm gonna watch some of your videos as well as give you guys advice on different decks you should uh, use, decks you should use and not use. Um, as well as things you've done well and things you've done bad. It's gonna be like a little segment that I do for you guys so I'm gonna pick one Twitch follower that is willing to let me watch you guys play. And, um, but I'll be able to put it up on YouTube. So my goal is to do it every Thursday. Dan House is gonna share them. Um, I'm gonna do a quick example of what I'm gonna do. It's talk about your replays, give you guys some help, advice. You can listen to me or you don't have to listen to me. It doesn't matter, but uh, All right, so this is what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna watch a replay. I'm gonna put it in times to kind of like analyze of what you guys are doing correctly, what you guys are doing incorrectly, what you guys need to do. So <clears throat> Dan House plays the giant, plays the uh, um, pff, archers. Could have done a little bit better on that because uh, he could have played that sooner, but he's going in with the graveyard. Ooh, graveyard on graveyard. But he throws that goblin deck perfectly to be able to attack both towers, and he's already at his main tower as well. That was a beautiful combo, and he did really well on that. Thank you for the follow, uh, Gold Nova. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream, Charmander, as well. Um, ooh, great job, though, against the Fire Spirits, even though it took them all out. The Giants should be in front of the Archers, but that's fine because he has that graveyard just going to town through the Goblin Barrel a little bit too late because they were taken out instantly. Well placed though, Tombstone on uh, Dan House side as well. But he's in the lead currently right now with two archers walking down. Barely was able to place that right in front. And here comes the graveyard as well as the minion horde. And he's able to get there in time. Not just kidding, he played the skeleton army. And on that, he should have tried to hit the uh, fireball on the skeletons as well as the miner. And now out of desperation, Dan House tries to go for that main one, but instead he should have played some defense as well. All right, so that is kind of how I will be doing. Coach Chris is watching each of these videos and sharing it. So here we go. <laughs> he lost against the Trump 2006 student too. That just makes it that much better. So let's go to the killer. All right, here's the second one. He's doing the graveyard deck again. He had a really nice combo in the beginning, but he needs to be able to continuously hit that combo and save up for that combo. So great defense. He has that golem going. That's fine. That's why you have the tombstone there to take the damage. So now he can really set up shop. He should, nice job, through the archers in the way. And here comes the graveyard. Boom, great job. I would have waited on that fireball because the fireball wouldn't, is not gonna take out that Mega Minion as hard. I would have put the Goblins, but still, that's fine. He was able to take a good amount out, as well as that Minion Horde taking out that whole left side. Good job on Dan House's side. Archer's placed perfectly. He'll be able to take those guys out, as well as the Goblin. Boom, 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 walk, walk, walk. Fire Spirits, eh, that's fine. He should leave that Tombstone there. We'll see what Dan House does. Thro smart move on throwing that Giant on that right side. And he's slowly walking, 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 walking. He's kind of confused on what to do. He should throw the graveyard now. Um, also, no, that's not bad at all. He freaking charged. That was great. The guy didn't even know what to do. He just gave up. That was 
really well played. That combo too, when that hits, especially in that arena, they're gonna cry. <laughs> All right, here's the last one. We got Dan House versus Harmon. Oh, so it's a different deck that Dan House plays with. Looks like he has a Hog with the Rage. Let me fast forward this real quick. All right, throws the minions down, takes it out. That's fine. That's an 8 5 sw uh, 7 5 switch. Hey, Captain Gerbil times two, everyone. All right, took out that, sorry, took out that right side real quick. Nice job on that. Let's see how he defends. He's got to throw a oh, skeleton army, good. Takes that thing out as well. Boom, there goes the minion horde. Easily takes it out. If anything, Dan House should have played the hog at that time to take out that final tower, but that's okay. He just needs to send a fireball or, or the prince. Boom, well done. Uh, he could have finished it faster with the hog, but that's fine. Yes, I did zup that deck is really good awesome job on that so that, this is like my example of coach chris so i'll choose one of you guys watch three of your games maybe four depending on that give you advice on what to change in the deck as well um with dan house's last deck i would change that rage spell out with a fireball um just because he needs another like spell but you know overall that was a great job um alberto tacos how much is it oh um All right, let's watch Zoop real quick. Zup, sorry. And then I have to go and eat. You guys have been awesome. That's why I'm still staying on. This has been lots and lots of fun. Um, Alberto Tacos. I still can't believe that game. Holy crap, dude. That game was insane. Oh, man. That was good. All right, so we got Wizard on the right side. Oh, this isn't Zup. Sorry. I don't know what this thing is. What are you doing? What are you doing to me, Zup? No, that's just an arena. All right. All right, guys. You guys are awesome. I'm trying to get out of here. You guys have been freaking amazing today. Make sure you guys tune in to Mobile Monday tomorrow. Like I said, we have our giveaway. Boom, over our poster. Signatures right there. Woo, we hit our 500 followers. And then after that, once we hit 600, we're going to be giving away Google and Apple gift cards to people who are in our stream watching live so for those of you who always tune in you guys have a better chance of winning these giveaways because it's been so awesome and you guys have killed it keep killing it keep killing it we'll be back on tomorrow with our big giveaway grand prize so peace out shaka bro hauser von Raylan.